As a former chef in a two Michelin star restaurant, I would like to give it a try to make the perfect wing stop chicken tenders. Thank you very much for watching. If you didn't do so, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my small YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Capcom Man. A hard speed to the city streets. We began to feel the fire. We rise like so building. I use chicken breast and cut it in tender like pieces. Perfect. Then we add seasoned blend, salt, black pepper, cayenne pepper, paprika powder and garlic powder. The recipe you can find at the end of this video. Also I'm gonna add one egg white. The reason that I don't add the whole egg or egg yolk is the fat content in the egg yolk is 4.5 gram. Compare this to the egg white, it's only 0.05 gram. Any fat content in your coating or butter can make your chicken coating soft. That's why I use egg white only. I add my seasoned blend, my egg white and set aside for minimum 6 hours. You can also leave it overnight in the refrigerator. And for this recipe we're gonna make the original Wingstop hot sauce. What is a combination of beautiful flavors? We use Heinz tomato sauce, the original one, honey, apple cider vinegar, I use Tabasco hot sauce, paprika powder, garlic powder, cayenne pepper, fresh black pepper, salt to taste and melted dairy butter. And when you combine all these beautiful flavors and you add a small layer of coating on your crispy chicken and this entering your mouth, it creates a nuclear explosion of all these beautiful flavors, the spice, the sour, the sugar, little salt, crispy outside and juicy chicken. It's just beautiful. Let's start with the sauce. Taste. <laughs> and a little salt. The first coating is just plain white flour. Be aware that you cover each part of the chicken with the coating, otherwise later the butter and last coating will not stick. We shake off the excess flour and transfer to the butter. The butter is made out of plain white flour, water, a little bit salt and white pepper. Let excess butter drip from your chicken and transfer to your last coating. The last coating is flour, cornstarch, little bread crumb and seasoning.
Then we're gonna deep fry our chicken golden brown in oil 360 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius. I have to say honestly, I'm not really a fan of fast food or fried chicken, but this is spectacular. Just beautiful. Thank you very much for watching Ice of Richard make this beautiful wing stop spicy chicken tenders. I hope you like the recipe, I hope you're gonna try it. And please don't forget thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Kapko maak.